Hey everyone, it's Benicia, your community outreach specialist, and today I am bringing you another five things video about someone very near and dear to my heart, Ashley, community engagement assistant. Let's there go. you go. You got it right the first time. I did. It I'm so took proud. long enough. So proud. Just I kind of hesitated though. I don't know if it'll come no across on it. camera. Yeah, but I hesitated. Okay. One, bear with me. This wind. It's like Pantene commercial. You could just like here. have like braids. You just have like really nice braids, and you won't have Maybe that next issue. time. Yeah. Number one. One. Let's see. Let's start with my. I know all of her five things. Like my that dirt bike incident. Let's do it. Yes, because I'm not the only clumsy one at this agency. She is mm -hmm. not. Mm -hmm. Um. So a couple years ago, I think it was the day <laughs> after. Hi, Major. Hello, are you <laughs> How, How are you? Doing? you? <laughs> um. So a couple day. No. I'm lying. The day after, <laughs> day after Christmas. So mm -hmm. I have an eight-year-old brother, and he got a dirt bike. And I was like, "Oh, this is so cool! I want to go on it." From a couple of years ago, though. So he was like six. Okay, okay. Christmas from a couple of years ago. Not because I was like, I'm making this so much more complicated than it is. All good. Anyways, so, so <laughs> I wanted to try the dirt bike. Mm -hmm. So you know, I'm in the back, I'm going. Everything's great until this one turn and I might have taken it a little too fast and seems like it I was like ah. and then what were you like <laughs> ah. and then it was like boom 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 and I smashed into a tree that's cute and I looked down blood dripping out of my knee I had blood on my head everywhere so I was like oh crap I'm gonna need stitches my mm -hmm. mom's not gonna like this um, so I start. My mom's not gonna <laughs> like this. I'm gonna need stitches. So I start walking up to the house. My cousin sees that there's just blood everywhere. So mm -hmm. he's coming to get me. Um, yeah, I needed seven stitches in my knee. My mom was like, "Really? Like this? This, this had is to happen?" This is what we do. Yeah. I just want to point out the dirt bike was for who originally? My brother. Okay, your six-year-old brother and you being much older than six were the first one to crash it. I just wanted yes. to clarify that for all I of our- I had to make sure it was safe. Of, oh, okay, and apparently it was it's not for you. not safe for me. Exactly. But, uh, okay. <laughs> but it was a good time. So exactly. got stitches mm -hmm. and I was still living in Miami at this time. So I was like, crap, I need to drive back. I'm still trying to go have a good time for New Year's. So I drive back after I got my stitches and made it out on New Year's Eve, stitches and all. And oh, I was, had a moment. I was right. out on New Year's Eve and fresh, stitches and mm -hmm. I started feeling a little woozy so I was like well I need to sit down that's about it but I still made it out oh I'm a trooper kind of I swore you I feel like I know a story with you and you had like one of those little things that you like your knee like your knee is bent and you're like on a scooter and you're like wheeling with one foot I that would have been pretty cool but no yeah that was never me. mind all Just right kidding. I apologize number two um, so that's one so crash the dirt bike mm -hmm. um two fun fact I was born at McDill Air Force Base that's really cool for those of you that don't know McDill Air Force Base is in Florida Tampa like closer to downtown Tampa Bayshore yeah. Boulevard over mm -hmm. in that area um the really hospitals pretty. yeah it's beautiful mm -hmm. hospital is no longer there but that's kind of cool I was born there um three what's number three Let's go with, um, I went paragliding in Germany, so that was pretty cool. That's really cool, so you're like, forget it, I just don't want to go paragliding in America, I'm gonna go to Germany and go paragliding. It was cool. Yeah? Um, so Ooh, we were like starting to, I could find the picture for you. Yeah. So we were starting to run Clip. down, and then um, something was wrong, and the guy I was with was like, no, we need to walk back up and then go again, but I made it down safe. No stitches, nothing, we're good. I like to live life on the edge. Just a little bit. Okay. <laughs> um, this is why I know everyone, nothing of what I'm thinking I'm gonna say. I'm accident lot. prone. That's, yeah. yeah. So the guy that would say, hey, we're running down this cliff to go paragliding and something's wrong. I would tap out and I would go another day. No, I had to make it down. Okay. So. Okay. Um, not that I. was three, right? That was three. Okay. That was number four. Four. I know some things about you, but I don't know if we're gonna say them on camera. I don't remember that they were for this list. All star. All star. All star. 
Okay, so if anyone knows me, I am obsessed with baseball. Mm -hmm. um, living in Miami, I got the opportunity to work for the Miami Marlins, mm -hmm. which was pretty cool. So I did a little cheer, fan engagement kind of thing. Mm -hmm. um, and it was cool because that was the year we had, we were hosting the All-Star Game. So I got to work that whole week, home run derby, lost my voice, it was awesome. You do some cool stuff. Also sprained my ankle when I was up on the dugout before, that was fun. On the dugout? On the dugout. Like, is there footage probably somewhere of you, like, rolling and spraining your I ankle? really hope not because, so... It's my new mission. I was, like, I jumped up and came down, and my ankle kind of just rolled. Oh. And I was, like, oh, But no, it's my new mission to find good. footage somewhere. Yeah, so got down. It's going to be some down. random girl that got hurt at a baseball game. It's going to be Ashley. Me. I'll be like, that head, that head looks familiar. I had blonde hair. Who was this girl? Who was this girl? I know you with blonde hair. So mm -hmm. that happened. I went back in the locker room and my ankle was like oh. all different colors. But I you wasn't. You still enjoyed yourself. You still had a great yeah, weekend. It was yeah. great. It was, it was worth fun. it. Saw a lot of people. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. Five. Bring it home. You you were going through this a lot quicker than I thought you were going to. So I will give you credit for that. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, let's see. So I like to do outdoorsy things, mm -hmm. clearly dirt bike, paragliding. Mm -hmm. um, also went whitewater rafting once. That's cool. It was pretty cool. I always cool. wanted to go. It's fun. So Where'd you go? They let you, I think it was called a Koei rafting, I believe it was called. Mm -hmm. Location. Yeah, so that is either Tennessee or North Carolina. I don't Can't remember. Can't remember. One of those. Just does so much and travels so often. <laughs> but um, <laughs> so they let you like, so the raft comes to like a little, point mm -hmm. and you're able there's like a little handle there and you could sit up there if you want and go down like rapid titanic style like you're just like ooh, yeah like toboggan style yeah i love so it i did that and fell off and my family was like oh no where'd Every she go story is like i have a new fact but at the root of it all it's i'm clumsy yes so i fell so off okay. but clutch i was still hanging on floating in the water so i was like Woo! <laughs> okay so no. i'm alive i just picture like you being you know that's something guys she's taller than she looks I, I was gonna am. say i just picture you being like little underneath the raft like I was kinda just and that's not like a side. i was like Woo -woo. oh <laughs> <laughs> that's i can i can just picture it i am taller than 411 yes we were just gonna say she's legally not considered a which is 4'11", for those of you who didn't know. She just barely passes it. I'm five foot and three quarters. There's a pen on our wall in the office to prove to mark her height. It's that serious. I'm five, five and three quarters. I'm just short. I mean, if I look taller in these videos and pictures, that would be good. But I'm short. If it would you be ever an see illusion. me in person, it would be false advertising. Oh, well. So if you see me in person, you're going to be like, whoa, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for tuning in with us for this video. Hope it was quick, sweet. Hope you learned something new about Ashley. Basically at the root of it all, it was one thing and that's she's super clumsy. Yes. Thanks for tuning in with us. Like if you haven't already. Subscribe if you still haven't. I'm really confused. Same. I want a plaque. And three, comment. Nice comments. What, what should they comment today? Wow, you really just, I went blank. 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 Um, you should comment what's your favorite number i don't know that's the first thing that came in my head mine's 24. mine's two why is yours two um because i oh, okay huh. no because it's like normally like normally and in Okay, we're not gonna say normally, but okay, whatever. Two people in a relationship, um, two hands to hold, uh, two halves to make a whole. That's um, cute. I like even numbers, odd numbers really freak me out. Like, Same. really freak me out. Same. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know. I just always like the number two. Okay, that makes sense. I yeah. just like 24 because I like the number 24. Oh. But tomorrow's the 24th. Is it? Yup. That's cute. So, I'm gonna have a good day tomorrow. 124. Yup. 2019. 24 is an even number, so it should make you feel. It's 2019. The whole year is going to be wonky. On that note, see you guys next time. <laughs>